Hello, and welcome to Fresh Service. Today, let's talk about the Incident Management Module. With Incident Management, you can get insights on how to create, assign, work on, and resolve incidents. Incidents can be created via different methods. For instance, the end user can simply email an issue to your service desk, and an incident ticket will be raised automatically. Or they can do so by submitting a ticket in the self-service portal. As they fill the form, smart suggestions display the knowledge base articles based on the subject line. This saves time by deflecting recurring tickets, letting you and your agents focus on issues that matter. Agents can also create tickets on behalf of employees if they reach out through a phone call or walk over. Once the incident is created, the customer will receive an acknowledgement mail with their ticket details. Let's take a scenario where the IT admin needs to assign every ticket to the agent individually. With a huge volume of tickets coming in daily, it becomes a tedious task. With Fresh Service, you can automate the ticket assignment process. The first one of these productivity boosters is the Round Robin feature, where you can automatically assign new tickets to the next available agent. The supervisor runs through your ticket every hour and performs tasks when specified conditions are met. This supervisor rule, for instance, checks if a customer has not responded in a while and sends a reminder on your behalf just so you don't have to find all such tickets and type out the response manually. Another productivity booster is the Workflow Automator that lets you automate repetitive tasks and complex processes. With the Workflow Automator, you can assign incidents to a particular group and even set up a multi-stage approval process with drag and drop functions. We're just scratching the surface here. There's a ton of processes you can automate with one or a combination of these uber cool features. Once the ticket gets assigned to you, go to the Tickets tab and filter Me in the Agent section and view all the open tickets assigned for you. Click on the ticket to access a detailed view where you can find all the options to modify and update a ticket. While replying to your customer, you can use the canned responses to avoid typing similar responses and include placeholders for a personal touch. You can also include relevant solutions articles in your responses. Be sure to link the ticket to an asset in case the requester missed out. You can add notes to document the troubleshooting steps for the particular ticket so it gets easier when handed over to a fellow agent. You can also go one step further and use the Discuss option to chat with your fellow agents to resolve tickets. If a fellow agent is involved in an incident, you can add them as watchers so they get an email notification whenever the ticket gets updated. The ticket's due date is determined by SLA policies that can be set and changed by the admin. Once you get the issue fixed, add a concise note on the resolution and set the status as Resolved. Then click Update. Once that's done, an auto-generated email with the Customer Satisfaction Survey is sent to your requester. Since you responded promptly, you know what the response is going to be. This brings us to the end of this video on Incident Management Module. Stay tuned for more videos with Fresh Service.